What is good, YouTube? It's your boy, Jogger Joe, ready to go with episode number seven of Pokemon Crystal Randomized Nuzlocke Challenge. Yeah, yeah. Now, today what we're going to do, we're going to get cut. We're going to cut through the forest, Ilix Forest, Ilix Forest. I actually don't know what it's called, the, how, the pronunciation of it, I should say. We're going to go through, we're going to get another encounter, and then we're, excuse me, and then we're going to get to the next city. That will be all of today's episode. But before we do that, let's get a quick team recap in your face. First and foremost, we have Fillmore, our Houndor, rocking Super Sonic, Sonic Boom, Double Slap, and Body Slam. Oh, also, he's holding a focus band because in the last episode, I challenged the gym, and I was afraid for Fillmore not being able to hold his own against the, with the other. With that being said, next we have Rallo, our Magby, rocking High Jump Kick, Mud Slap, Giga Drain, and Karate Chop, 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 Judo Kick. Next, we have Archer, our starter Pokemon, the Lugia. You can see that. He's right there. He's a Lugia. He's rocking Dragon Breath, Acid Spike, and Jump Kick. Next, last but not least, well, not last, but the last Pokemon to be introduced is Terra, our Lickitung, rocking Side Beam, Mega Drain, Swift, and Iron Tail. That is friggin' amazing. We have her, but she is the level 5 she needs to be leveled up. I believe, if not in this episode, in the next episode, she will be leveled up because you know what? I don't have time in this episode. In this episode, we all about get taking care of business. Yeah. We go uh, do that, what we got to do. We're going to get to the next city. That's going to be the episode. Let's see. Take a couple Pokeballs. I think I got like four. So I get, I get six, making it nice and even ten. Same goes for this. Oh, never mind. I'll take... An even three. Give me a nice and odd seven. I think. Cause I checked it before we started. Yeah. Yep. I was about to say like I checked it before we started, but I didn't actually know. But we go keep it moving. We go keep it moving. We go keep it moving. Yes. We're going to keep it moving. Hey, white apple corn berry. I think, should I do it? Should I do it? Yeah, you know what? I'll leave one here for him today. I make Pokeball from apple corn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We all, we all know about this. I thought he was actually going to have some uh, exposition about helping him get back his slowpoke. Whatever. Let's keep it moving. Let's go to the forest, walking through the forest, walking through the forest, walking through the wait. Actually, let me do let me do this. I'll give it yes. Yes. Because I'm just not I'm not in the mood to be stopped by idle Pokemon chit chatter. Now let's see, what are you talking about, big fella? Oh man, my boss is gonna be steaming. The far fetch that cuts trees for charcoal took off on me. I can't go looking for it here in the Ilex Forest. It's too big, dark, and scary for me. Oh, you big baby. Ugh, come on, man. There's only one other place you can go. Hey, it's the missing far fetch, dude. Why are you running for me, far fetch, dude? You know what's funny though? Like, looking back in my memories of memories, I remember playing. Like, I remember having to find the Farfetch uh, in the forest. Like, I, I remember that much. It was, it was weird. Oh well. Farfetch. Come on, Farfetch. We gotta take you back to your masters, your owners, whatever. Farfetch. Oh, oh, Farfetch. You ran into a tree, buddy. You can't be doing that. Let's see here. What do you gotta say? Aha! My far fetch! You found it for us, kid! Without it, we wouldn't be able to cut trees for charcoal! Thanks, kid! Now, how can I thank you? I know! Here, take this! Cool. Hey, now I have cut. That's the cut, HM! Teach that to a Pokemon to clear small trees! Of course, you have to have the gym badge from Azalea to use it! Yeah, I already I already have that, so I will I'll just 
Uh, wrong cut. I booted up the atrium. Who can learn? Everybody, except for Tara. Tara, you disappoint me already. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. I'm going to give it to Rollo. Because of all the moves that he had, I, want, I honestly want to get rid of High Jump Kick. Because that one had the most room for error out of all of the other moves that I know. Yay. Let's go. Wait, yeah, let's go. Hey. Hey. Yes, I want to use cut. Hey. We moving, moving. It looks for stride. It's the honor of the forested protector. So I'm pretty sure it's Celebi. I'm pretty sure, but I'm not. Oh, that's the thing. I guess that'll be question of the day. Should we beat the game? Should we beat the game? As far as like story mode all the way up to the Elite Four. Do you guys want me to do any post game playing? Like, because I'm pretty sure this, this, Game has some post-game stuff, Te like post-game technically. Uh, I don't know. Hey, a lucky egg! That is absolutely perfect. I'm going to give that right now, actually, before I forget. I'm going to give it really. I should have got seven. Uh, da -da 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 -da. give this lucky egg to Terra. Because when we go through and do our uh, between episode grinding, what, what's the purpose of a cleanse tag if I still run into Pokemon? Hold on a second, actually. I'm back. Heh. <laughs> if you know why I had to drop out of camera, you know me. But, oh well. Let's see. Let's, let's let's get out of here. Feel more. You could go up a level, but right now I'm not having it. I don't. I don't. I just want to get through. Get to the next. Uh, this is gonna be a short episode. It will be. I'm I'm openly admitting that. Oh God. So what's my encounter gonna? Be? <laughs> oh God. Did you? You're one of those types of trainers. You you let the daycare do it all. That's sad, bro. That's sad. Chef East it on. Oh, not another one of these. Not another one of these. Okay, granted. Granted. First off, can, can we talk about something right now? Can we talk about the fact that Electrode has no arms or legs? So how can it pick up anything to toss anything? Like, I'm more confused about the fact that you... No, seriously, what are you using to pick up and seismically toss? What are you using? Explain to me that. Oh, that, that scared the shit out of me. I was like, oh, fuck. Can you, use, can you live another seismic toss? Because if you can't, I'm going to be so upset with myself. Okay, bet. You could live another seismic toss. I'm proud of you. Now we're going to switch to Archer because, like in the show, Archer comes through and he he basically fixes everything in the end because he's Archer. What is with you in seismic toss? Like, like, like you don't actually know I'm not going to say that because you fuck around and have something that can, like, ruin my whole team. Well, not really, not really something that would ruin my team, but it's a pain in the ass to fight against. Oh God, I hate that. I hate when it feels like my nose is running and it's not running. Hey. God, your ass. Chef Esteban. Why did it end that way? Because I said so, that's why. But Route 34, we get an encounter before we actually let, let me uh, heal, let me heal my Fillmore. Now, let's see. Almost got caught in another encounter. Come on, what do I get? 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 Do I get? I'm gonna cover my eyes. Okay. Okay, this is a slash. Ha! I almost dropped my pencil. Sand slash. Now we get to see if I can catch it. 
Oh, the female. Hmm. Now I gotta start thinking of uh, female names. Let's see. Do I want a double slapper? Do I want a sonic boom? Sonic boom. Sonic boom on it. Bide is always one of those moves that scares me. Oh, bet. He can live. Oh, shit, snacks. I would rather. Oh, shit, snacks. I'm just so upset, like, I'm upset with myself. I am. What a way, what a way to start our, our relationship, Sam Slack. Who what do I want to name you after? Who do I want to name? A female. So I'm so I'm so disappointed. I, I am. Like, I don't even care. Like, I, I'm just upset. I don't even care, bro. I don't. Oh. Look, a teddy urcha. No, but seriously, I don't care. I'm just, I'm upset. I'm upset. Ugh. Yes, upset. God, man, Fillmore was one of my favorites. Dang it. Hold on, let's, before I have to. Damn it, I was so close to having a full team. I could just go in there and release them. Like, it will almost be easier, but I want to keep tabs on the Pokemon that I've lost. So. I'm just disappointed. I, I'm, I'm very disappointed. Penny, way to, way to start. Th that, that's a good way to start our journey together by, by killing one of my other beloved children. Let's see what the hell you got. Bide, of course. Rock throw, egg bomb, and dream eater. I'm getting rid of dream eater almost instantaneously. Like, uh, I'm so, I'm so upset. Actually. Huh. We're here. I actually don't know what the name of the city is. Hold on. We'll go out. Come back in. Goldenrod City. Now, what I was saying we were going to do, which we are going to do, we're going to end today's episode here. And what we're going to do is, in between episodes, I'm going to grind. And in the next episode, we're going to spend pretty much the entirety of the episode going through the entirety of Goldenrod City because Goldenrod City is a very big city. It's like the biggest one of the game, I believe. 
So, with that being said, if you would, please give me a thumbs up down below. Let me know that you enjoyed today's video. Comment on the question of the day. Also, comment down below how you think things are going and if you're sad on the loss of Fillmore. Also, would you please subscribe to me if you haven't already subscribed to me because if you just have not yet subscribed to me or just not doing life correctly. And also, would you please share this video with everybody that you know because sharing is truly caring. And also, and also, would you please, please, Support me on Patreon, helping me do what I do. Because you can help support a younger person like me. Now, with that being said, I will see you all in the next video. Holla at your boy. Hey!